Hello everyone, I'm back with more Super Ethical Shipping Climax. Uh, so I just loaded up back my last save. I realized that I was at the select screen, so I can just try another pony and then, like, see what else we can get into. Uh, also I realized why I picked a sugar cube corner thinking Applejack. Um, it's cause that's what she says, right? And I know that's a weird, that's maybe dumb, but... You know, she's always like, sugar cube, right? She says that, right? I'm, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to the apple barn. I feel like this should be sweet apple acres, but I just realized that, like, half these are just, like, you know, it's like, it's not even Rainbow's house or anything. It's Rainbow's cloud. Some of these are right, though, like sugar cube corner, carousel boutique, Fluttershy's cottage. But I feel like that's part of the joke. <laughs> Crap, this is one of the worst looking ones. This looks, which is funny because you could at least tell it's a barn and yet somehow it looks like it's not even sort of trying to be Sweet Apple Acres. After walking for a bit, you arrive at the Apple Barn in Sweet Apple Acres. The smell of apples is strong in this place. Apple trees are all around you. Ponies with apple related cutie marks run and apple products are on a giant table. Wait, is there some kind of party here? Here you go, every pony. Y'all welcome to taste the products of a good old family. An apple family reunion, as in an orchard owner's association or a real apple family reunion, as in family related by blood. Either way, you should probably leave them alone for the moment. Howdy, long time no see. Dashy, I did not expect you today. <laughs> I, I like how they will call me Dashy, not Rainbow Dash. I don't know why I like that. I just, it's cute. I like it. Sorry, you seem to be busy with your family, so I better leave. Rainbow Dash, after all we've gone through together, I consider you yourself a part of the extended family, you know? You better stay here for a while if you don't have more important stuff to do today. So, what have you planned for this year? Or things that I can participate in, I mean. Well, right now, you can either go to the nearest table and enjoy some food or try to catch some apples in the big bucket of water over there. Um... I feel like going to eat something sounds actually more sociable. Let's do that. I'm a bit hungry. I'll probably just eat some pie before Sora decides to marry someone in the family. Yep, take care. <laughs> and thus, he went to the nearest table to eat a bit. Once again, this really is old pony types. I'm so fucking nostalgic, dude. I hope that's not weird. And this won't even to insult new ponies or people like new ponies. I might have my disagreements with some of that, but I just this is this is the show. What I'm what I want what's on TV these days, the season nine MLP is kind of a different beast. What I'm playing right now is the fan is the the fan base of the show that captured my heart. Like I feel like I'm looking into a window to see that like the mind of someone else who also clearly had that experience. The show like captured their heart. Hopefully I'm not overstating myself here. Like, you know, hopefully I'm not putting words into the author's mouth, but I mean, he did make a game about this show between seasons two and three. He didn't be like, I'm gonna include in Starlight Glimmer because she's the coolest or whatever, you know, whoever, whatever. Now this is classic. Uh, you know, actually I should visit Twilight. I'm actually curious, I'm guessing she's not an alicorn in this game even. Like, I think it's that old school pony. A lot of ponies are here. Discussing, playing, dancing. But for the moment, you focus your attention on some apple pie. Howdy, um, AJ's friend? Oh, it's Blayburn. Yes, close friend. My name is Rainbow Dash. Oh yes, we met before in Appalooza. I'm Brayburn. 
Yes, with the Bloomberg, the You Gotta Share song and all of that. <laughs> Good times, you should come back someday. Maybe I will, especially if they're all as friendly as you are. Hint, <laughs> hint. You bet, but no pony there makes cider like Granny Smith does. Cider? Uh, well, I don't drink too much. You added a wink to your last comment. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, oh, don't drink too much. I thought it was I don't drink too much. <laughs> that makes a lot more sense. You know, I might. Handsome Stalin like you? What could you possibly want to blur with hard cider? Big Macintosh, for a stallion I met who did not react to my charms. Wait, you're like... Cult Cuddler? Nah. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing a really bad Bray Burton. I'm bad, like, I can do a southern accent, but I don't think I can do multiple southern <laughs> accents, if that makes sense. Unicorn or Pegasus, Pony or Buffalo, male or female, all have their perks and kinks. And I like some variety, you know? Yeah, whatever floats your boat. If everyone was like that, the world would be a simpler place. True story. I agree. Apparently, I'm not gonna bring up the fact that they're related. And... You're cute, Sugar Cube, but Big Mac is there. I'm gonna try one last time. We should meet again someday. Gives you a Sugar Cube and leaves. Well, let's at least eat something. Look at the table. And thus you ate without further noticeable conversations. After that, you went back to the crossroads. Getting the Sugar Cube was worth the trip, I guess. I guess so. Can I even check my inventory, or is it like, is that not a thing? I don't think that's a thing. I just know I have the items, I guess. Oh, holy shit! What is this? The ending gallery? <laughs> or just the CG gallery? Oh, <laughs> I don't know why that cracks me up. Oh, wait, is that the 44th? G no, there's no way, right? Holy shit! Oh, I thought that was just, like, a crummy drawing. That's the 44th picture. There's a lot more than I realized. That's a lot. That's, like... That's a lot. <laughs> Anyways. Let's go to the library. Now I've gotta see if, if Twilight... <laughs> it's just a fucking normal library. And I was joking about the other one, like, this doesn't look anything like Sugar Cube Corn. I mean, uh, Sweet Apple Laker. <laughs> I love it. I fucking love it. <laughs> it's so stupid. Go to the library. While going through its door, you see the purple mare living there. Twilight Sparkle. She doesn't seem to notice you. Oh, wait, sorry, it's a narrator. I need a deeper voice. <clears> hmm. <throat> You go to the library, and while going through its door, you see the purple mare living there. Twilight Sparkle, she doesn't seem to notice you, even after you close the door. Hello, Twilight. Hearing your voice, the mare stops what she was doing to face you instead. Oh my god, I was right! It's OG... Twilight Sparkle. No wings or anything. Damn, I'm oddly happy about that. I'm not even like someone who is mad about her getting wings. But the, it's just nostalgic seeing classic Twilight Sparkle, you know? Oh, Rainbow, what can I do for you? I'm looking for a book. The latest Daring Do book? No... <laughs> I'm pretty sure I made fun of this last time, if I remember right. I complained about how you couldn't, like, that you didn't know what your character was whispering. Though I have grown, uh, I have grown to appreciate, like, sounds. Like, you know, like, um... <laughs> I don't know. I think I like the joke more than I used to. A, A... 
Come on, Dashy. You are not Fluttershy. <laughs> A book about ponies having sex. Twilight. <laughs> well, that was unexpected of you. <laughs> At. Nice. That's fucking goodbye PG rating in Iran. <laughs> what? <laughs> Not that anyone from there would end up playing this anyway. Please don't judge me. I won't. But are you talking about... Yes, an adult book, not a children book explaining how to make foals, I already know that. Well, I should have someone somewhere. <laughs> Let's have a look. Let's have a look. It's in a book, a reading rainbow of sex. She looked everywhere and came back with a black covered book. <laughs> that's, a, that's an expression. Twilight needs a needs a a boop. I don't know why she just does. One of my personal books. I won't ask why you need it. Just return it when you're done. You have a pony pony graphic book. Don't make it sticky. Twilight wouldn't appreciate that. I was like, you know, you know, <laughs> fucking once again. Are we an English room <laughs> joke? You know, have a pony graphic book. Don't make it sticky. Twilight wouldn't appreciate that. Well, thank you. No worries. Now, if you don't mind, I have some other things to do. You can come back tomorrow. I will do, Twilight. Bye, Rainbow. <laughs> you skim through the book a bit while going out, but due to its nature, no description of it will be made. Not even when the... Especially not that. Ah. I'm losing out on all the good stuff in this game. Darn you. Now I'm even more jealous of, of both versions of Rainbow Dash. They get to read pony graphic books and I don't. Damn. Well, uh... Guess... So where haven't we gotten? Let's just, let's just go over to, uh... I forget who we always used to hate on. I think it was a rarity. I don't really... I mean, I'm gonna geek out. I'm gonna nerd out over all the main six. Hopefully that's that's still entertaining. Hopefully it's what the person who watched... <laughs> wants to see. Whatever. I'm gonna go to Fluttershy's cottage. I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep the meme alive if the meme is what I remember it being, which is that rarity sucks. Dick. Flutter, <clears throat> Fluttershy's cottage. There are birds, squirrels, bunnies, and other critters walking, running, and doing other critter stuff there. A nice wind is going through your mane and bringing delicious scents to your nostrils. <laughs> That's actually a pretty funny st statement. I like it. Um... Okay, this looks the most accurate. This doesn't really look like her 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 cottage, but like it's close enough, basically, right? Oh, and a yellow pony with a pink name is mane is close by. Certainly, Fluttershy. What are you going to do? Obviously, I'm gonna save. <laughs> But obviously I'm gonna pet the pony. Or to the critter without her noticing you. And when you start to brush her mane with your hoof. She didn't like that. Rainbow, I told you that, um... Seems that she and Rainbow Dash have something going on. But it wouldn't use that- But you wouldn't use that to your own advantage, would you? Uh, <laughs> shit, dude. <laughs> um, <laughs> fuck it. I want to see what happens. Uh, there seems to be a fucking lot to this game. So let's just go go all in. Be, uh, be as ridiculous as I want. You bet I would. Shh, just relax. That's it. Now come here for a bit. For, for a little wing hug. Just that, nothing more. You both hugged and kissed, 
and you are really lazy to the end the game so soon. This ending was so predictable. I still got some future pick, right? What are you dreaming about? This is the best you'll get. <laughs> That's funny. This is the best you'll get. It's so cute. I like it. I, I'll take it. I'd fucking take a hug from Fluttershy. Okay, uh, here everyone's like, thanks for playing. Okay, I gotta see if- oh, oh no, I just skipped it again. Shit. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's, let's play this proper. Let's pet the bunny. Go near the little animal and bend your poke, po, po knees. <laughs> fucking get it. It took me a second. I was like, what? Approaching your hoof. But he quickly turns his head and runs away. Oh, please excuse his attitude. Poor little cutie bunny doesn't let strangers touch. Oh, Rainbow! I didn't recognize you at first. Don't mind Angel Bunny. He's just a bit of a bitch. Would you like to come in? I got my teapot on the stove. We could have some tea together. Sounds like a fire hazard, doesn't it? By the way, you, know, you at home, go check the batteries of your fire alarm. If you took them off, shame on you. You're endangering the whole neighbor. <laughs> nice. Don't worry, my fire alarm is still good to go. I, I know because it's super sensitive when I cook. Sorry. Yes, sure. Then please, follow me, Rainbow. And both of you went into the house. A nice, cozy place. Holy shit. This looks way nicer than your real house, Fluttershy. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> this isn't your house. Yes, it's a stock image. Haven't you noticed all the other ones? <laughs> Have you seen Pinky recently? Anyway, please sit down. I'm going to the kitchen, and we'll be back soon. This house is just oddly co cozy, though. I want to fucking take a seat and relax here, even if it's not Fluttershy's cottage. It's better. <laughs> I said it. No problem, Fluttershy. And she headed for the kitchen. Some muffled noises could be heard. Like those of cups being placed on a plate, and soon after, silence again, well, except for all the forest noises. Fluttershy went back in the room. And there it is, some nice hot tea. New recipe. I hope it will be good. First time trying it. Don't worry, f worry? Yes. Don't worry, Fluttershy. I'm sure it will be the best teas, one of the best teas I'll have ever drank. That was a sentence. Th thanks. Jeez, some there are some, because of the fact there's no eye outlines, I don't know if it's intentional, but some of the, t some of the expressions look a little weird, I'm gonna be real. Blushes slightly at the comment, and both of you sip some tea. I guess there you go, anyone who's wondering the importance of giving your characters, uh, outlines on their eye- uh, on their, uh, eyelids, there you go. Oh my, the taste is quite good! What's in it? Oh, some herbs from the Everfree Forest. Zahor- Zakora helped me choose some, and- oh! Right, she said that for a good taste, this plant you shouldn't miss, but to drink too much and you will search another bliss. I don't know what that was supposed to mean though. Ah, oh, nice. You j it's clearly an aphrodisiac, should I tell her? Um... <laughs> no? You're right. Why should you drug a cute, helpless mare? I'm fucking terrible, dude. Holy shit. I feel bad, but I also don't. <laughs> which is, which I should probably feel bad about in a roundabout way. Anyways, I have no idea. Sorry, Fluttershy. 
Don't worry. I should have asked her. My bad. I mean, it is kind of your bad. It's also my bad, but it's also your bad. And you drank, and drank this aphrodisiac tea until... Oh my, it's so hot here. Or is it just me? I'm afraid that it's a bit of both. It's hot here, and you are too. She blushes. Rainbow, would you mind... Hugging you tight until the afternoon ends? I wouldn't mind at all. Well, she's even more in squeeze and approval. And you ended the day in each other's arms. I sure, I just would go with who's happy together. Nothing sexual happened. The end. Damn. <laughs> my, my fantasies of drugging Fluttershy will never come true now. Fluttershy ending too. <laughs> okay, I gotta try this for real now. I'm sorry, I'm just sorry I can't stop laughing. Okay, here's credits. Let's see if I can catch some of those thank you credits. See what some of the, those their credits said. Three things, not by Jin Star. Oh, um. Thanks to the amazing DVR Pony Vector Club. They do amazing work that was used in the development phase and also this demo. Thanks to everyone who was involved in the My Little Game Dev Marathon all these years ago, this game wouldn't exist without it. So all the following peeps upload their Let's Play demo on YouTube, especially the first pair. Without hearing people laugh, oh my gosh! If I have some freaking advice for you, slow that shit down. Maybe make it like, you know, also a visual novel, right? Make it like a visual novel through the credits so I can click through, uh, wait, can I get like check history on this? Nah, I can't. Damn. I'm gonna, like, at, at, at this point I'm just gonna, like, pause it on my own time, like, cause I can. But, and I guess people watching the video can too, come to think of it. But, like, obviously, actively playing the game, you can't, right? There's, there does not appear to be a pause function for the credits. Um, it was fun playing through again, though. <laughs> I'm gonna try to get as many endings as I can. Holy shit, there's... <laughs> I have played an extensive- sorry if I seem like I'm over- I don't even know how much of this game there is. I just haven't played like an- even a semi-extensive pony game in a while. Which is why I feel so surprised. I'm used to ones that's like, oh, you'll just get like a little bit of content, uh, you know, you get a platforming stage and that's the- that's the game. Like one or two. This looks like it has a lot going on. I mean, it is more than a demo. Uh, thank you all for watching part two, though, and I hope to see you more on the next super ethical shipping climax. Uh, I was really ethical today.